First of all you will need to create an application in Discord Developer Portals, open in browser and search Discord Developer Portals, click on the first one, now go to application section. Wait a minute! Who are you? It's your favorite doctor, lawyer, teacher, plumber, astronaut, gamer, Johnny Sins here. Click on new application, enter your application name which you want, and then click on create button. You can also upload a profile picture if you want, go to the bot section, and click on add a bot. Click on yes do it, now go to OAuth 2 section, scroll down and select bot, and select your bot permissions which you want, once you did, copy the invite link of your bot and invite the bot to your discord server which you want. Once you invited, go to the link from the description, and click on the fork option, now wait for some time. Once you did, copy this key from the description, go back to replace.it, click on the lock icon, in key, type mongo underscore uri, and in value paste the key which you copied from the description. Once you did, click on add a new secret key, and type bot underscore token, and in value you will need to enter your bot token. You can get your bot token just by going to the bot section, and you can get from there. Copy the token and paste it in the value section. Once you completed all these steps, click on the run option to make your bot online. It will take some time for the first time because it will install all the recommended files. Once your bot is online, go to your server and check the bot if it's working or not. You can type your prefix and help to get the list of all the commands. And you can change lists from this button. If you want to get all commands at the same time, just type your prefix, old help, and you will get all the commands at once. Let me use any one command to check if the bot is working or not. So you can see the bot is working, and it send message to the member which I selected. There are about 100 plus commands which you can use easily, like moderation, fun, giveaway, and much more. And if you want to change your bot prefix, just go back to repil.it dashboard, go to config.jsn, and you can change your prefix from there. Now let's talk about how you can host your bot 24 7 hours for free. To host your bot 24 7 hours, copy this link from your replace.it dashboard, go to Uptime Robot website, Create an account if you don't have one, click on add new monitor, select HTTPS, enter your monitor name which you want, and enter your URL which you copied. Once you did these, just click on create monitor and again click on create monitor, and you're done. Now your bot will online for 24-7 hours. This is the easiest way to host your bot on my opinion. So this is the end of the video, thank you for watching, and see you later.